My previous videos were dedicated to different patterns and methods of trading, but those should always be practiced. So today I'm going to show you a few trades and of course with their detailed analysis because this is probably the main reason you're watching this video, right? So today I brought to you some really interesting trades. Leave comments about what trading tool or patterns you want me to make video about and let's start. Life was like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. We've already seen a similar pattern in my previous video. This is the bullish version of a symmetrical triangle. Upon pinpointing the trends on the chart, we see a narrowing corridor within the borders of which the candlesticks are. In cases like this, I would usually wait for the market to reach the lower trend line and then buy a call option, expecting the pattern to form up. But in this particular case, the chart is very predictable, so we have a plenty of time to bet down. And that's exactly what I do, put 3 minutes. While we wait, let's talk about this chart's movement. What do I expect from it and what it does? The candlestick should bounce off the higher trend line and go down. Having reached the lower line, the market will go up again and this time break the pattern. Our trade turned a profit on the way and for you not to doubt that it was a bullish triangle and I recorded how the chart acted after that. The second example is rather simple, but let's analyze it nevertheless. An uptrend and a corridor the chart gradually follows. On this stretch the market goes down until the lower trend line. Having tested this zone of support, it will go down again, so we get a put option that expires in 3 minutes. It is to note that here the bulls were trying to resist for quite a long time, so it shouldn't be a surprise that the candlestick went up so far. But the bears on this stretch were much stronger, so the market eventually fell to where it needed to be, and we got a profit. Here on this 10 minute chart we see a downtrend. The market has reached its lowest level and went up towards the level of resistance. The only thing that can pose a problem here is the increased volatility that can lead to the chart bouncing off and going up a bit. But I just choose a longer expiration time, 15 minutes and wait. Because of the volatility, the market did form a lot of additional levels of support and resistance, but eventually went down. Exactly what we needed. I made this next trade with the help of the alligator indicator. You can watch a video about it here. Let's set the 3 minute time frame and see. So what do we see? There is an uptrend uh, gradually going in waves that repeat themselves and that is the pattern that's going to help us. After a steep incline the chart goes down to the previous level of resistance that becomes the new level of support. The indicator tells us that the turnaround has started so we buy a 5 minute put option and wait.
So that was it for today. I hope this video was helpful and you learned to understand the market, its patterns and movements a bit better. And just a quick reminder, all my explanations and the analysis of all my trading activity, and also my trading signals, can be found on my Telegram channel, so consider subscribing. See you guys very very soon, stay safe and be in touch.